नमस्कार मायसेल प्रतीक एंड इन दिस सेशन वी आर गोइंग टू डिस्कस कंसेप्ट ऑफ एक्सेप्शन हैंडलिंग एंड टाइप्स ऑफ एक्सेप्शन लेट अस स्टार्ट दिस सेशन देयर आर नंबर ऑफ रीजंस ड्यू टू व्हिच रन टाइम एरर्स मे बी रेज्ड ड्यूरिंग द एग्जीक्यूशन ऑफ ए पीएलएसक्यूएल ब्लॉक ऑल्दो वी कैन नॉट एंटिसिपेट ऑल पॉसिबल काइंड ऑफ रन टाइम एरर्स बट वी कैन हैंडल मोस्ट ऑफ एरर्स in a meaningful way by using the concept of exception handler the exception handling allow us to handle runtime errors smoothly without abruptly terminating the code or without throwing error to the user or calling environment as you can see here in plsql block we have three section one is declare section which is used to declare the variables the business logic is written in the begin section and this exception section is used to handle runtime errors or exceptions declare an exception are optional part while begin is the compulsory section so in order to handle runtime errors smoothly we can add exception section in our plsql block it is important to note that when a runtime error occurs in a begin block the control is transferred to the exception block and once an exception is raised and control is transferred to the exception part it cannot return to the execution part of the program it means when a runtime error occur in this begin block the control is transferred to exception section and here the exceptions are handled and once the control is transferred to exception section it cannot return to the execution part of the program The trapping of exception is further illustrated in this figure in begin block exception is raised and when the exception is raised the the control is transferred to the exception section where exception can be trapped sometime all runtime errors are not handled by this exception section or then exception is not trapped and in this case exception will propagate to the calling environment we can always add exception section in our plsql code to handle most of runtime errors and if error is still not handled by the exception block then it will propagate to the calling environment or the error will be returned to the user the syntax of handling the exception is as follows in exception section we have to use the command when exception name then and group of statement so you can see that when exception 1 or exception 2 or exception 2 is written in square bracket means this is optional then is the keyword here we have a group of statements 1 and 2 which will be executed if exception 1 is raised during the execution of plsql block we can also add another when statement when exception 3 or exception 4 then do this but if raised exception is not available in this list then we have another exception handler named as others which can be used to handle all kind of exceptions that are not listed in this list and exception block is terminated with end so when other is very important feature of exception handler in this code if raised exception is not in the list then this part will be performed let us consider some more examples to understand this case in this example we have two exception handlers one with exception 1 another with name exception 2 if during run time exception 1 is raised then this will be handled by this group of statements if during run time this exception 2 is raised then it will be handled by this group of statements when raised exception is neither exception 1 nor exception 2 then these runtime errors will be handled by others exception handler it is also possible to use only others exception handler in exception section in this case all runtime errors will be handled by these group of statements now let us discuss types of exceptions there are two kind of exceptions one is implicitly raised exception and second is explicitly raised exception implicitly raised exceptions are raised automatically by the server due to runtime errors and explicitly raised exceptions are raised by the user 
implicit raised exceptions are of further two type one is predefined oracle server errors and another is non predefined oracle server errors we will discuss implicitly raised exceptions in our next video session so this is all about concept of exception and its type to read more on this you can refer my book simplified approach to dbms which is available on amazon you are requested to subscribe to this youtube channel to receive latest video tutorials on topics like data mining machine learning dbms big data no sql and many more to learn sql in a simplified way you can join this free online course on sql which is available at udemy platform i also authored books on data mining and data warehousing no sql beginning with sql and pl sql for beginners all these books are available on amazon to read more on this you can refer my website pratikbhatia.com thanks for watching this video